One line for the one man. Two and a half miles in front of Denny Hamlin. Does he have enough gas? They think he does. more turn no gain. and half of that long straightaway until he sees the checkered flag it would be his third win of the 2022 season but more importantly it would be career win number 49 tying him with tony stewart he's gonna win at pokemon again lap of the race. Worried about the race car. Thought he'd hurt the car. Gabe Hart calms him down. They get back to work. All types of strategies. Well, they spun. I mean, coming off of two, he spins, and he's still able to do what they do. A lot happening today for this Lemon team. Denny Hamlin, man, he has such an incredible record here. Spinners are winners. Track seems to fit him well. Winningest driver ever at Pocono. Now he has separated himself. A Hall of Fame career, goodness, dude, and right now. We thank you for these men and the way they work together. Thank you for all of us. The only thing missing from an incredible career for Denny Hamlin is a championship. And with three wins, he's closing in on being the favorite again. Look at that smoke. Very inconsistent start to the 22 season for Denny Hamlin. He got wins, but he had DNFs. He had wins, but he had four finishes. That's why he wasn't up there in contention for the regular season championship. Wasn't as consistent as some of the other teams, but now with just five races before the playoffs begin, Momentum is definitely on the 11 team side. Looks like the left rear tire had blown out as he makes his way back up to the flag stand. That was excellent. Oh yeah, Denny. Woo! Woo! 
Some moves there for Denny Hamlin. With a spin Saturday, Denny, the lap one contact today, the spin in stage two today, the fuel concerns at the end. How did you overcome all that to get back to victory lane for the seventh time in Pocono? It's the team. They just uh, were able to come back with a great strategy there to get us back up front uh, from the mistake I made. <laughs> Taylor in for a hug. Oh, crying tears there. Oh, look at that. Hey, hey, no crying. Because if you cry, I'll cry. <laughs> this is not a drama movie. Denny, I think the booze might be from the contact with the one. So was that straight payback? I mean, what'd you, what'd you want me to do? <laughs> what'd you expect me to do? Um, you know, it was, uh, we got position on him and uh, he just ran out of racetrack. So let's talk about it. Is it now over between you and Ross Chastain in your book? Oh, I mean, we're, we're going to just keep racing hard and, until uh, we get the respect uh, back from these guys. And, you know, it's not just that. You, you know, we've been wrecked uh, four times, twice while leading in the last 10 months, and that's just, uh, I'm at the end of it. Denny, this is win number 49. It ties you with your former teammate, Tony Stewart. You also won behind Junior Johnson right now. Did you ever dream or ever believe, and you actually passed Tony Stewart, did you ever believe you would be at this point? No, never. I mean, I just wanted to be a local short track racer in Virginia. That's all I really cared about. But uh, I was able to get a, a great break from J.D. Gibbs, and that's why I'm driving the number 11 for Joe Gibbs Racing. And I uh, just got to say thank you so much to Toyota, um, FedEx, Shady Rays, the Jordan brand, Coca-Cola, uh, everyone who makes this possible, Sport Clips. Um, yeah, it just it feels good to win here at Brooklyn. One more thing. What's your reaction when you hear those boos from the fans in the stands? I hear more cheers than boos. I tell these booze guys to shut up. Hall of Fame numbers, and again, the only thing lacking right now. Let's go get him. Let's go get him, girl. He's won every crown jewel. He just has not been able to capture that first championship. But at 49 wins, and as much success as we have seen out of the 11 team, and Denny Hamlin, the 41 year old from Chesterfield, Virginia definitely a hall of fame career already and he's still going and his daughter's going to take a ride can't believe i'm still recording over nine minutes because of because of denny's daughter up here in the shot Taylor's riding along right now. He has another daughter, Molly. Not with him right here, but can you imagine what it would be like? Your hero, your dad, she's booed on the straight. I'm sure that's emotional for her. The only one, the only thing that matters right now is he's got to go win another race and give give the other give the other daughter a ride. That's so right. that, you, know, you can't give you can't give one one thing and not the other. That's the way I, I understand it that way at the early stage of fatherhood myself. But I'm gonna give Taylor a ten on car entry. Yeah. One foot, head for a second. Old school. That was back like uh, like 1988, watching everybody get in their uh, cars in the garage area. That was a throwback to the old school manner to climb in a race car. And she's all smiles now. As our